ease up. He hasn't ordered yet. Hey, Kim, how do I punch in my ATM card? Shall we worry separately, or is this a group effort? Uh, yeah. Is Zach there? Uh, Zach, it's for you. Who is it? I didn't ask, but the voice sure sounds familiar. Don't push that order button, Greenberg. Call the bank and tell them about the glitch. It's not a glitch. It's paranormal. It's a glitch and you know it. And how do you know what I know? Besides, you're just some crazy customer service guy. Oh, yeah? I know you're worried that you won't get home in time to watch the indoor shopping channel. Wrong. It starts at 4 o'clock. I have plenty of time to... Yikes! And how do you know about the indoor shopping channel? I'm your conscience, Greenberg. I hear everything you're thinking. Everything? Kim, if my conscience calls again, I'm not in. Over the edge, Greenberg. Stop where you still can. Anybody here go by the name of Greenberg? Look, if I wanted your help, I'd ask for it. I'm not asking for it, so get lost. Kid. Zach's conscience actually called him on your cell phone? Can you believe that? I hate it when he gives out my number. This calls for drastic measures. I'm going to have to wire Zach's body for sound. Too late. He already left. Look, we, we can't help Zach if he won't help himself. Guys, Zach needs our help. He's become a shopaholic. Uh, any suggestions? We could have an intervention. Gather around everybody that knows him, tell him that we care for him, and that this need of his to shop is changing him. Tell him that we love him. Wait, we'd have to say that? Out loud? No way! Now this boombox is more than just an underwater entertainment center. It's also a portable, solar-powered microwave oven. Sweet! But wait, there's more. Do you hate burning your fingers on those freshly nuked cobs of corn? Well, then you need these handcrafted stainless steel corn holders. And if you corn are now, holders. you'll receive... Man, I knew I was missing something. Three graphite Swiss-made golf tees. Guaranteed... Hello? Hello? It's me. I'm giving you one last chance. I don't want one. Just leave me alone. You're serious? Yeah. I won't be back. That would be too much to hope for. Okay, then. I'm out of here. Hello? Conscious? Wow. He's really gone. Now I can really shop till I drop. Hello? Yes, I would like the boom box, the corn holders, and the glow-in-the-dark bathroom scale. And, what the heck, throw in the whole bathtub too. Yeah. Toast? Well, I'll take two. Oh, the bank called this morning. There was an error made to your account. But the manager said he straightened it all out. Did you happen to check the account balance? No. Why? Oh, no reason. Um, hey, Dad, can I have some eggs? Yeah, sure. number now. Your current balance is five dollars and fourteen cents. I'm a dead man.
When? Yes, I have the money and I could loan it to you. Thank you. But I'm not gonna. What? Zach, that would be enabling your compulsive behavior. Gwen, will you stop with the psycho babble? Look, if I don't have that money back by four o'clock today, my dad's gonna kill me. Is that all that you worry about, Zach? Not getting caught? Where's the guilt? Where's the buyer's remorse? Maybe you need to have a chat with your conscience. Well, we're not exactly on speaking terms. I told him to get lost. You what? He's gone. Goodbye and good riddance. Zach, did you ever stop to think of the paranormal consequences? Spence, don't start with me now. I need help here. You guys can trust me. I'll pay you back. How can we be sure? You have no conscience. I don't even know why I'm wasting my time with you guys. Kim won't let me down. He doesn't have a conscience either. Vernon, borrow from Vernon. That's the best idea you've got. No, that's my second best. My first best is to bite the bullet and confess to your dad. Oh no, my conscience must have called your conscience. This is a conspiracy. Zach, get a grip. It's time to cut your losses. But Vernon, Kim, that would be the most appalling, humiliating, degrading. I'll take it, but you have to ask Vernon for me. Okay. But you know Vernon, he never does anything for free. There's always a price to pay. Greenberg needs cash. My cash? And, um, what are you, Dunlevy? The designated groveler? I'm authorized to negotiate the loan. Pity. Seeing him squirm would give me great pleasure. I might have even lowered the interest rate. Let's cut to the chase, Vermin. Exactly what is it gonna take to get a loan for Zach? He's getting a loan from Vernon? How low can he get? We've gotta talk him out of this. We can't, he has no conscience, remember? Unless... Well, hey guys, sorry, uh, Zach's not back yet. Can we just wait in his room until he does get back? Yeah, sure, come on in. One last chance. I don't want one. Just leave me alone. I was right. This was Zach's last call. So? So? We just punch redial, and it'll connect us to the last caller. Zach's conscience? Okay, if you think you can do that, you're sadder than Zach. Listen. This is Zach Greenberg's conscience. I'm not in right now. Please leave a message. This is Spencer Sharp. I have a request to make in the name of...